thought the panasars were coming for lunch, not breakfast. Well, it's going to be a candlelit dinner if I don't get a move on. Do you know what? I cannot find anything in this kitchen anymore. I've still got pretty artichokes. I've got to do the baked Alaska. I haven't even started on the ice cream yet. You really think this is a good idea, going into business with someone who's done time for murder? We need money, and we need it fast, all right? So unless you've got a spare hundred grand lying around, I suggest you help me out. Where's, where's Mum? Got to see about the lease on the pawnbroker's site. She's still pretty cut up about last night. Maybe you could have a word with her girls. Oh, yeah, because you're not angry at me. Oh, I'll try, I'll try, I'll try, but later. Right. Wash your hands, right, and dice that for me. If I nail this deal, they'll be on board. Remind me why we're here. Do you need a hand in there? No, 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 no. You, uh, you just relax. The Muse Boosh are on their way. Go. Sorry about the wait, but I mean, you'll find it's worth it. I don't like to blow my own trumpet. No, of course you don't. It's uh, my own special recipe. Artichoke with a touch of fennel and a dash of pasties. <laughs> New range for the chippy? Uh, no, that place pretty much runs itself, which means I'm available to give 100% of my time to this new venture. Um, speaking of which, I've done a business plan and... Yo, let's not skip to the main course before we've had our starters, eh? Anyway, I thought this mysterious Cindy was a business brains. Where is she? She'll be here shortly. Let me get you another drink. Look, I know it's a large outlay initially. And what exactly are you bringing to the table? Well, 30 plus years of restaurant experience, vision, and I would hope my culinary prowess speaks for itself. These projections show, right, even at a conservative estimate, that you will make your money back within two years. Look, I'm not disputing it's a good opportunity. But why'd you come to us? You're the obvious choice. Successful, ambitious. What, you're desperate more like. You seriously think I've forgotten about our last business transaction? <sighs> that was a misunderstanding. It was an unfortunate no, turn No, you of... humiliated me. I told you, he's a weasel. You can't trust him. Well, if I'm that bad, why are you here? Well, I couldn't resist. The thought of watching you grovel. You don't strike me as the sort of man who will let past mistakes stand in the way of making money. And this, this is a good deal. And I can't afford to get into bed with someone who's likely to stab me in the back. <laughs> Shouldn't have married her, then. And look, you're the one who spent time behind bars. I mean, if anyone should be worried, it should be me. Right. Okay. This meeting's yeah. over. No, 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 come on. Look, I, look, that came out badly, OK? Look, everyone deserves a second chance, and this is yours. It... 